Here we are guys. It's Friday morning. It's time to do this. It's time to weigh in and see if I lost even just one pound. Even just one pound, then it would round me up to 10 pounds. Okay, let's do this. So I am at a loss of 11 pounds now. Praise God. Now I'm going to have me some coffee. Well, guys, I'm about to eat my first meal breakfast after the weigh-in. So I'm going to be good. I made um, an omelet with cheese. I really want some toast. Not going to do it. This is all I'm having. Three egg omelet with a little bit of cheese in there for flavor, salt and pepper. And this is what I'm having for breakfast this morning. I'm adding water in this week. I'm going to challenge myself to drink one of these every day. Can I? Can I do it? Honestly, I don't know that's a lot of water, but I need water. We all need water. So I'm challenging myself to drink one of these every day. It's noon, so I'm gonna have lunch and I'm having leftover salad from last night. I just dumped the whole thing in my bowl. So this is what I'm gonna eat for lunch. A yummy, crunchy salad. Just finishing up with dinner. Chloe wants egg rolls, you guys. Egg rolls are a staple around here, especially now that we have the air fryer. But I roasted a chicken or I instant potted a chicken, deboned it. So I'm having rice and chicken and she's having rice and egg rolls. Here is my plate with some of that shredded chicken on a bed of rice. This is what I'm eating for dinner. Here is my current water situation. Just a little update. I'm halfway through. I'm halfway through. It's been hard. It's been very hard to get this water down. But I will do it. I will do it. This is my Saturday morning breakfast, you guys. Oatmeal and coffee. We are heading out to a wedding. It is about three o'clock. I have not had lunch, so I'm eating on some crackers. Um, we did cook for the wedding, so we've got um, pork butt and chicken. If there's any chicken left by the time that I go through the line, I'm gonna opt for chicken. But for now, crackers for um, an in-between snack until we eat dinner. We are leaving the church, just leaving the wedding. I didn't eat anything but cake. I had cake. I didn't eat any of the food. So I decided to spend all my calories today eating cake and it was amazing and it was good, but I'm hungry. So that could be an issue. Um, so anyway, I'm just trying to end this vlog and he's trying to look to drive. So, okay guys, that concludes my Saturday. Sunday morning guys. I just got off from doing my Sunday morning devotion. I'm starving. I'm starving. So I think I'm going to make some scrambled eggs before we go to church today. So let's go scramble some eggs. this 
yummy egg. Mmm. So good. Come from church, guys, and Patrick is stirring up some meat for our... What are we making? We're throwing a bunch of stuff together. Goulash. <laughs> a goulash dish for lunch. Good Monday morning. I'm getting ready to eat some breakfast for the day. Um, and this is what it looks like. Just the basics, except this time I added cinnamon right there for a little more flavor. So what do we got here? We've got butter, honey, and cinnamon. And it's totally perfect for this cool morning. My windows are already fogging up. The sun's out, but it's cold. No lunch today. I'm skipping straight to snack. It is um, about after school time. She's virtual school now, so we're on our way to get Jonathan, and I'm going to eat this. And we're giving him gummy worms, and I'm not going to eat any. Just a quick update. I feel wild. I look wild. It's Monday. My grandson's playing in the background, so you're going to hear some cartoon stuff going on. But I made soup for dinner, and it's pretty good. It come from Pinterest. It was like a chicken noodle soup recipe, but you add bacon, and you add ranch to it, and it just gives it, like, a unique flavor. So this is what I am having for dinner. It's Tuesday, y'all. Okay, so I just got home from taking the grandson to school. I've got a lot of stuff I need to get done today. So this morning, I'm just going to have some cereal. Breakfast is served, y'all. Look who's up and going this morning. Actually, it's lunchtime. Yeah. Someone had a rough night last night. I'm sorry. I'm trying to eat this soup that I made last night. As you can see, it's not as watery. It's like the noodles have soaked up that um, chicken broth goodness. Creamy so, goodness. Creamy goodness. This is what I'm having for lunch, guys. It's dinner time, and we cooked outside. I was going to eat outside, but the chickens wouldn't leave us alone. I'll put that video up here of our campfire food experience, whatever. Okay, so this is what I'm having for dinner. Here's my plate, if you guys can see it from the sun. Pork chop, green beans, and some uh, cheesy potatoes that we made over the fire. It's going to be yummy. And then my water. This is dinner, guys. It's breakfast time around here. What are you having, babe? I'm having a toasted egg sandwich. And I'm having eggs. <laughs> I'm getting ready to do a smoothie. I'm going to call this video this week, How Not to, to Lose, lose weight. weight. I've got coffee, my eggs. He's having toast with his eggs, and I'm doing a smoothie. This smoothie came out really thick. Like, I could put it in a bowl like ice cream and eat it with a spoon. That's how thick it is. But I'm going to leave it. I could have had more milk, but I didn't. Um, milk, honey, and strawberries is what's in the smoothie. Then there's my egg. Look who come to Grammy's. <laughs> Miss Layla come to Grammy's. So, she's hungry. I made her some cereal. Decided why not. So, I'm having cereal with Layla. 
afternoon snack. It's three o'clock. <laughs> See you, homie. <laughs> it's dinner time, guys. It's hard to do this when the kids are laughing. <laughs> okay, so macaroni and cheese. They really like this, so I made it. I realize it's not good. I've really done bad this week. And then in these packets, we have pork spare ribs. Don't they look yummy? You want to see? This is what we're having for dinner tonight, guys. I'm just going to give you a quick show um, before I have to jet out. i got to take this little lovely home. Are y'all making fun of me? They're making fun of me. So just for that, I'm going to put this in there. <laughs> Y'all can see I'm not home and I haven't been home. I haven't been home to have breakfast and it's now 11.30 so I'm going to make tacos for lunch and that's what I'm going to have. Actually, I did have one of these. It is a peach. No, it's an orange mango and this was really good. I would do this again. So this is what I've had today. That and coffee early this morning. So he wanted tacos so I'm going to make us tacos when we get home. Taco Thursday. Is it Thursday? Lunch is served, guys. He's got his tacos. I'm trying to move his sauce. Tacos. I have my sauce. And I got mine right here. No tortilla for me. It's just layered. I think we've had this before. I've showed this before. Because last time, you couldn't eat, remember? Yep. So, we're redoing it. <laughs> You're actually able to eat this time. This is lunch, guys. Hey, guys. It is about 6 o'clock. I haven't had anything since what you guys saw. Um, well, I've had coffee and water. But other than that, I haven't had any food. I haven't had anything to show you guys. I'm actually just chilling. I'm just chilling. Um, we are fixing to leave to go to a small group. Sis and I are. And I'm probably not going to eat anything until we get back. And maybe not even then. I'm not really sure yet. I've really been sitting in here pondering the week, what I've been eating, and I'm really not expecting to lose weight. Um, I'm actually afraid I might have gained weight, but honestly, I didn't care this week. I didn't care enough to discipline myself not to have the pastas, not to eat high carb food. So I can't really cry about it because I just didn't feel it this week. I didn't give up, I just slacked big time. I didn't have self-discipline. So this next week, I need to get myself back into that motivated state of mind, being determined, being mindful of what I'm consuming and how much of it I'm consuming. Less pastas, <laughs> more salad, more fruits, more vegetables, um, and I have to have meat, of course. So anyway, if I don't see you guys back here later, I will see you in the morning. We'll meet at the scales. Good morning, you guys. It's weigh-in day. It's Friday. It's week five. So honestly, I've already confessed that I don't feel like that I did good this week. I just know I didn't do good. I know what I ate. The stuff, the carbs, the, you know, pasta. So let's see what the skills say about it. Are you guys surprised? <laughs> just a few ounces. A few ounces has made me have to clock in a pound gained. <laughs> so I'm not giving up I'm pressing through this week. I say this every week, but really guys, this week I've got to stop it. I've got to stop eating stuff that I know I shouldn't have. I have to stop it. So there you have it guys. It's a new week and I've got my coffee. This week I'm drinking peanut butter cup. Yay! Skinny syrup. It's been good to me. 
Even the water challenge this week was really hard. So I'm going to continue that. I'm going to continue trying to drink the water that I need. It's so important that I do this for many reasons, mainly my health. I am really overweight and I know the Lord has told me that I need to take care of my body. I need to control my eating. I need to eat things that are going to fuel my body, not make me fat. I also know that food has become an addiction and it's a demon that I need to conquer in my life. Gluttony is real and it can kill you. So I'm getting it under control little by little. That's what this weight loss journey means for me. Yeah, I'd like to have a beach body, but the most important thing is my health. The Lord knows my future. He knows what's down the road for me. And I think this is a warning. This is a warning. He's telling me, eat better, do better, watch what you consume. He may be saving me from health conditions down the road. So I'm going to have my coffee and I'm going to think about breakfast and make smart choices. Thanks for watching you guys. Have an amazing day.